Welcome back once again to Chukur Sumli. We are reading Lamrimia, making life meaningful day by day. And we are on day 120. Let's get started. Day 120. Just as a seed grows until it breaks the surface and becomes a plant, negative imprints ripen at the time of death to determine our next rebirth. End quote, Lama Zafari Poche. Text. When somebody dies with an extremely negative mind and it is destined to be and is destined to be reborn in the hell realms, they experience a terrible death. A person who is going to be born in the hot hell realms feels very cold. No matter how high the heating is turned up, no matter how many blankets they are covered in, they still feel unbelievably cold. They shiver uncontrollably and become demented with cold. The karmic seed left on the mental continuum motivated by ignorance becomes stronger, manifesting as a strong craving for heat. And when they finally die with their mind full of that craving, it throws them into the hot hells. Conversely, if someone has the karma to be reborn in the cold hells, that person will feel incredibly hot at the time of death. They will feel as if their body, the bed and the whole environment are on fire and will crave coolness. No matter how cold the room, they will still feel as if it's a furnace. Dying with this craving for cold, they are propelled into the cold hells. There are many stories of people having fearful visions just before they die. People who have killed other people or who are regularly slaughter animals, soldiers and torturers, people whose mind is full of violence. Such people have a terrible death. Very often their last hours are full of dreadful images as if they are already in hell before they die. Their mind is strongly clouded with negativity and since they have never done any purification, as they leave this life, the karma for a hot, for a hell existence starts to manifest. The three big recalls of the day are, one, a person about to be reborn in the hot hells will feel intense cold at the time of death. Someone heading for a cold hells will feel incredibly hot and die craving coldness. There are many stories of people having fearful visions just before they die. Well, that's it for today. I hope you'll join us again tomorrow. And I hope you have a great day or night, wherever you are. Bye-bye from Chukur Sumlin.